audit. Now there's a word no one's thrilled to hear. But when it comes to measuring water use in your landscape, an irrigation audit can actually put money back in your pocket. An irrigation audit is a simple way of finding out how much water you use in your landscape. With some inexpensive tools, you can adjust your watering schedule to meet the needs of your landscape and cut down on your water bill. Let's get started. To perform an irrigation audit, purchase some short plastic rain gauges from your local lawn and garden store, or you can make your own rain gauges out of tuna cans. Place the gauges around your landscape and run your sprinkler for 20 minutes in the early morning when it's not windy outside. This method works for automated and manual sprinkler systems. After 20 minutes, measure the depth of water in your rain gauges. Find the average from all the gauges. Then, multiply that number by three to find your hourly irrigation rate. Here, we've got about a quarter inch of water in our gauge. When we multiply that number by three, we see that we're irrigating at about 0.75 inches per hour. And here's the final step in our equation. Take your hourly watering rate, in this case, 0.75 inches, and multiply it by the number of hours you water per week. If you water four days per week for about an hour, you'd multiply 0.75 times four. That equals three inches per week. Make sure to account for rainfall. Three inches of water doesn't sound like much, does it? Actually, that's about three times the amount you need for established Bermuda grass. In fact, most grasses require no more than one to two inches of watering per week to stay lush and healthy. Here are a few tips to help you save water. Adapt your watering schedule to the weather and season. Turn off your sprinkler system before it rains and consider installing a rain sensor. Lawns may require watering once or twice during dry winter months. Fully developed plants require less water, so reduce irrigation as your plants reach maturity. Create independent irrigation zones that account for the sprinkler type, sun exposure, shading exposure, and soil type for each area. Inspect your sprinkler system regularly. Check for leaks, clogs, damage, or other problems. And the simplest tip of all, turn your sprinkler system off. Grass may turn brown and dormant during dry periods, but it will green up when rainfall returns. Want to learn even more about conserving water? Watch another video and squeeze every drop of efficiency from your landscape.